All right, guys, how y'all doing? Cameron here. We're actually just working on um, doing some more of these videos. I think I actually finally figured out what was going on with my mic, why it sounded so deep. Apparently, it wasn't getting enough power. But I'm going to do some more of the Instagram critiques and reviews and seeing what Instagram is feeding us as art and give my opinions on it. Um, also, I do have a channel reward on my Twitch where if you want a critique or review, of your uh, social media profile on Instagram, I will come and I will record a review and upload it. Um, now, with that being said, let's get into it. All right. <clears throat> uh, I skipped past this because a little bit of questionable content up top. So, I like this pig. I like the, the brush strokes here. I think this is actually digital. No, this, I don't think this is this traditional let's but I like it I like the um yeah it's totally digital. I don't like, it. like uh yeah I'm a little confused but I think that um the fur lines are very clearly delineated here I like the kind of left up left up and undoneness of the bones I think it adds to it <clears throat> I wish um there was just something a little like that hit this bottom side and like the fig was looking at maybe but otherwise I really like it it's an adorable pink we give them that like uh ooh, nice hands very clean lots of cool line work going on here <clears throat> apparently they're doing studies of hands right now trying to figure out what they're doing but yeah, I like this. We can give them that like. Very nice. Clean sketches. Sketches are a way to win me over. <clears throat> <clears throat> Sorry, Sonus. It's, it's not the road, I promise. Um, This is dope. I like these statues. I like the legs coming out of their head. I like the heads coming out of their heads. This is cool. Is this by? Yeah. Let's check this out real quick. Is this by this person? It is. Wait, I can't read that. This looks like a curation page. All right, so I'm not gonna be shouting this person out because uh, don't know if it's the artist, but I like this piece. I like the lighting on it. <clears throat> this is cool. I like that. How is it self-portraits by Jim Poiré if they're all different people? Oh, no, they're all the same people. Okay, this is a very talented portraitist. Very, very familiar with his own face. I like it. I like this green undertone on this one. This is a little too, but it conveys the, light, the lighting properly. I think of all of them, this hoodie one's probably the best. Yeah, definitely the hoodie one. Wait, what? Okay, normally, not for fan art. This is cool, it is unique, it is well executed, and it's not something you see when you normally see Princess Mononoke pieces. I, I love the attention to detail and the wolf pelt. I love that the skin is background color. I love the high contrast Bauhausi and feel of it. Just excellent piece. Uh, we're going to make sure we put them. Hey, no. Uh. All right, we're going to add a tab. That way I can remember to put them in the description. Ten by ten. Mm. This is a one day stay. This is excellent, actually. I need to get better at portraiture myself, so maybe I need to get some more contrast in the faces. But <clears throat> yeah, uh, I love how the hair actually just 
it feels like it's glowing. And I think this is a very, very well drafted execution. Give them that like. Oh, and get to get their name. Because I'm trying to remember, this is for promoting artists, and we want to promote artists as well as like enjoy their what they're doing. And I don't tend to sit and like look at enough art. I like these figure studies. I think they're very clean. This is a great example of the contrapposto. I love the inclusion. Like these are what five minutes? Yep, five minute studies. <clears throat> I think it's uh I think this is great. We're gonna give him some props. Dude, is this painting? This is dope. Like just this is realism. Like the definition of realism. It's just like everyday life that you would see. I love that. And the artist is Catherine Gatham. So we're gonna go look at her page. Oh, she has some progress. Process shots of it too. That's awesome. So yeah, back to uh, the explore page. See what else Instagram has in store for us. This kind of has like a tank girly vibe to it to me. <clears throat> um, I don't know if I like the stylization here on the ears. I feel they're just too large. If that is the stylization thing they're doing. I am aware of that. I just I don't know if I'm personally. I think it kind of takes away from the character. Um, the hand, oh, the body is very well drafted. I like the, the aesthetic they use for the cigarette smoke, the convenience store bag, everything else. I like the ears take away just a little bit. It, maybe 75% of what they are, and they're still oversized ears, but, uh, you know, I like it, but I think the ears probably just tad bit. my liking this is one of those pieces that is going to be a fantasy book cover it is just a fantasy book cover it looks really good it's very well executed looks like a fantasy book cover and this is a uh, curation one so we're not throwing that up but I like that that was a cool piece it looks good. Let's see what this is. People on a train in the mask. Every person in the subway. This must be the artist. My name's Peter Fan. Oh, dude, he's just, I like his work. Yeah, this does cool. Very good at the realism thing. Give him that like. I like the Lincoln, but it's a little for twenty five minute demo. This is amazing. Very clean. I love the structure. I mean, you you get the sense of age on him with all the details that generally signify age. Very well done. I think we already have Eric and guests. Yeah, we do. He's posting a lot today. Dude, what is this? Is a fly on a couch just chilling? Dude, this... Let's see. Oh, dude, this thing is big. Yeah, that's like three foot tall. I, I like it. I like that. I'm a sucker for really cool bug things. I like this concept. This is a cool concept. The execution is done very well. Um, Alfred Basha is the artist here. It's not Inks PW, so follow this at Alfred Basha if you like it. I, I think this is, if you're wanting to get into pen draftsmanship, look at stuff like this. This is the way to go. And uh, looks like we're getting close to our um, time. I'm going, and I want to thank everyone for coming by and hanging out. Um, don't you know this is a YouTube video, so don't forget to do all the YouTube things like comment, subscribe, ring the bell.